Well, hello, my sweeties. This is Candy Girl, and I've got a little VR that is a video response for Phone Jones's Halloween challenge. She is doing an awesome first time challenge for her on her channel where you have to create her a shaker, um, shaker item and a memory decks card and i got that down yes i did so yeah so um y'all all know phone jones if y'all don't know look it up and subscribe to her channel okay <laughs> because she's awesome she is super funny she does cute little crafts and um yeah so here are the items that she asked for plus an extra i will get into that so first here is the shaker any type of shaker item so this is my, um, I've done shakers before. I mean, you know, I'm getting better and better at it, but you know, I, I, I'm going to be looking into a fuse tool because I want to get like when it, I want to make them a little bit more professional, so to speak. So anyway, this is kind of a large size shaker. It's like the size of a, like maybe a card and yeah, I love me some Frankenstein. Okay. As y'all can see, Frankie Stein, <laughs> my little Frankensteins come to join me for my video here. So I have this large um, Frankenstein cute sticker and he's like a happy Frankenstein here. Now my intentions were to put like a little globe in his hand and then put the shaker, the, the um, sequence in there. But that wasn't working out quite, quite right because I don't have a um, fuse tool and I'm totally going to be getting me a fuse tool. I need to up my crafting game. So I'm going to be getting a couple of um, crafting items sometime later this year, probably for Christmas. So I just put the um, sequins in there and I thought it was super cute. I put these, these, uh, puffy little Frankenstein stickers there. They're lined in orange and phone Jones loves her orange and she also loves green, her favorite color. So it just says, let's be Frank, <laughs> Frankenstein. And so the back, this is just some heavy brown cardboard. Um, and then I had a little bit of green glittery paper. I don't remember where I got it from. So I figured, and you know, he look at that. He's outlined in some kind of like sparkly um, silver like outline. These were giant window stickers. That's what these were. So I just, I wanted to do it like kind of like cool kind of, I don't know, disco-ish. I don't know what I was, whatever. But I put the, the strip on an angle there on the cardboard and then to cover the brown cardboard because I didn't have enough green to cover the entire thing. So then I just used some um, shiny um, green, dark green washi tape across the sides on the bottom, on the corner there and at the top. Folded it over. On the back, as you can see, there's the brown. I left that brown because it's still pretty. And then I just put the leftover green all along the sides and it just says made by Candy Girl. 2019 and some really cute little um candy corn stick um stickers on the back and yeah and then i mod podged the whole entire thing underneath the plastic because um when you try to put stickers or anything glue anything onto um glitter paper it doesn't really stick that well because i after i had put it together i didn't mod podge it yet then i was noticing like the letters were peeling up and you know it wouldn't look right if she got it and then the letters were off okay so i just mod podge it all on everything still stayed nice and shiny which is awesome because he's supposed to be a happy frankenstein and yeah there goes the um sequins yeah i didn't put that many in there because i wanted to make sure that you see it. i wanted her to see his feet his feet is actually cute but you can't see it there so that was this there's the shaker i gave her a larger larger size one because you know i just had to put a giant Frankenstein in there. <laughs> so that is Frank right there. My husband, my man. <laughs> so um, then I made a really pretty um, memory decks card. Uh, I don't normally make memory decks that much. This is only like the third time making it. And this is like my favorite memory decks card I've ever made. Because I actually had the actual die cut set. Thanks to Miss PJ, she hooked the sister up. And she sent me some nice cutouts. And then I was able to get the proper shape for the memory decks. Because I've made two before. But I just basically did the two by three inch. Uh, is it two by three? I think it is. Cutout size by cardboard. And, you know, the whole puncher thing. And I'm not really fond of that. You know, they were okay when I made it. But this is better. This is more memory decks-ish. So, yeah. I think she'll be happy with this. So, um, yeah. So, I had the paper. 
the um, orange skeleton paper I put on. And this is really like thick because I I um, sh cut the shape out of um, cardboard, heavy cardboard, and that's glued in between. So I just put two memory decks uh, cutouts on both sides so it wouldn't be flimsy and now it's nice and thick. So you hear that? It's a nice thick memory deck. So if you're gonna do a memory deck, you should always like make it heavy. So the cardboard is in the middle. I put these green and clear gemstones on it because Phone Jones's favorite color is green. And she said she's starting to love orange now. So they got some orange in there. I put this, uh, this is a thick sticker. I don't remember where I got this from. But this October 31st sticker on it because that is her favorite holiday, Halloween. I put this cute pop out, uh, kind of a puffy pop out silver skeleton on there holding a little pumpkin her favorite word boo yes i put that on there sticker green and orange her colors um and then i put this really cute spider sparkly um sticker here and then i put some um I, the green gemstones for his eyes to make it cuter more sparkly he has some crazy looking eyes up under there so i just want to make him look cute I am not a big fan of spiders, guys. As, as I said before, sometime soon, by Halloween or on Halloween, I have a story time for you about a spider. Okay, so, yes. <laughs> so, I had this, like, a uh, strip of some, like, glittery, sparkly um, skull, like, something that I glued to the side there. Hot glue. And then I put that there. And then I had some pretty Halloween cupcake liners that I had gotten in front mill. Excuse my nails, guys. They are crap. I know. That's some paint there. And it wouldn't come off my nail. Anyway, pink paint. So I had these cupcake liners. I took the spider web one. I had two. There's another one inside. I rolled it up. I was trying to do some kind of like rosette flower thing. But um, I'm having bad. Um, not bad. It's pretty bad. It comes comes and goes arthritis pains in my hands and wrist pain it's a probably a combination of carpal tunnel and arthritis so I was messing with it trying to crinkle it right I couldn't get it right and it actually hurts to hold my heavy ass phone in my hand right now because I'm not using my tripod so let me hurry up with this so yeah I just rolled it up and made some kind of like little like thing here <laughs> I put a little star um silver embellishment there some little spider little embellishment thing i glued to the top so that is that that's pretty cute i think she'll dig it and then on the back more um, paper on the back with my info colors and crafting and all that my birthday so a candy a bat and a star sticker on the back and i had this other cutout thing that i wrote my information on so that is that. And then I put it in this little bag. You know, I, I always save these bags from like where you get the stickers from because they do, they work great for your pockets. Oopsie, almost knocked the phone. And then I um had this little brown plaid, which is really pretty. I would love a plaid shirt in that color. And I made like a little mini bag topper for the top. I used my decorating pink staples. I have these pink staples that I got from eBay. The color kind of came off on that one, but... Um, the pink staples to staple it on and there we go she can take that off and take her uh, memory decks out but I just wanted to make it look cute when I send it to her so there we go there goes that and then um, there's a really cute um, Halloween card in there for her oopsie my little owl is falling I'll just lay it down right there so there goes my little diva pumpkins and my little Frankenstein collection <laughs> um oh look at Charlie Brown there as Frankenstein, we have this little bopper thing that I got from Dollar Tree. And there's a little cutesy Frankenstein from CVS. Let's get back to this. And here's a little project that I made for her that I thought was pretty interesting. I know Phone Jones uh, said that she's starting to like, like coins, decorative coin things, you know, whatever. So I had this round tag from my clothing. I'm starting to save my clothing tags now because I always think crafts when I'm... <laughs> even buying clothes so this was a, a nice cardboard round tag and I was instantly thinking I'm gonna make a coin for phone Jones so I had this another cupcake liner which was really pretty this this like Dave the Dead flowery type of skeleton cupcake liner and then another one on the back which is the one that's rest in peace one so I made a double double-sided double coin I cut it into the shape of the thing 
Um, and then I Mod Podge it on. I love using Mod Podge for crafts. It's so pretty. And I use the um, glossy Mod Podge for this. As I use the glossy Mod Podge for that too. So y'all can see it still stays shiny in there. So I use the glossy Mod Podge. And then I just glued on. I mean I put these little yellowish goldenish um, stickers on the eyes. To make its eyes literally pop. <laughs> so that's awesome. And then on the back, I just put the red and black rest in peace um, Mod Podge um, on the um, ooh, cupcake liner. So, yeah. So, Phone Jones start, said she likes the coin. So, I made her one. I made her a Halloween coin. And, yeah. So, I just have a couple more things to add to this package. She'll definitely get it by um, Halloween when she will be drawing her winner or whatever the case may be this is a fun challenge because yes i love halloween just as much as she does so yeah and i love my frankenstein as i said <laughs> so i just have a couple more things to add to the package within another week or so whatever she'll be getting it soon and this was fun guys so all right thank you so much for watching take care stay sweet i gotta go put some something on my hand because my hands are hurting all right Take care, stay sweet. I will see you guys soon. Bye.